Yo, what's going on, guys? Never mind me, man. I know this ain't RC and all, but I'm out here just out here wrenching on the um the money, getting ready for spring. Changing my primary jets, man. But just doing a little something, something, man. I gotta get I gotta get all this going, yo. I gotta get my bike uncovered. I gotta get the old school, old school out. I gotta get the snow blower back in the corner. Man, I just I gotta start. I gotta get this stuff together, so. Let me get back to this, and uh, you guys can go ahead and get back to the RC stuff, man. All right, guys, so this is what we're going to do today. We're going to take the XX5 body. We're going to spray on some liquid mask. All right. We got um some spaz sticks paint we're going to use. Cause like this is going to be a racing body. You know what I mean? So no need in sending it out and getting it all fresh and everything. So we got some candy gold, 15209. Uh, some candy purple, um, 15559. And we're gonna have a backer of uh, some high gloss black 00119. Alright, so I got a few few cans of each. Um shouldn't be that difficult to do. Um I'm not doing any kind of special designs or anything. It's gonna be a primarily candy purple with a couple highlights of the uh, candy gold. Um for the masking, that's what we're gonna use. This is my uh CH gun here is the number there. I think I paid forty dollars or so on Amazon. Got a good pressure regulator um, and a oil separator, so we can spray on the masking. All right. So we're going to use a filter, get some masking in here, and I'm actually going to use this. Just keep this as my masking gun. So I'll do that. All right. So let's. Uh, I've already ran some um, some odorless mineral spirits through this. Cause like I said, you get a brand new gun. Make sure you get some mineral spirits, get any kind of oil and everything out of the inside of the gun. So, I've never done this before with this mask on this body. And we're going to see how this goes on the SX-5. We got the, um, the mask uh, straining. Um, I, I kind of I threw a little bit of water down inside there to dilute it a little bit for the gun. So I don't know what the what I actually got it at now. I don't know if it's I don't think it's quite 50 to 1. Well, 1 to 1, 50 to 1. Yeah, I guess it'd be 1 to 1. It's not quite 1 to 1. I don't think it's 50% water and 50% mass, but it's somewhere close to that. It's got a nice little consistency now. I'm gonna mix this up now that I got it strained. And uh we'll throw a little bit of masking on this body. We're going to dry this off quick, get another coat on here. But this was pretty simple. I'm just worried about how much this thing, uh, you know, is watered down. So I think it might take a few coats. No biggie though. More time than money is what they say, right? So let's see. So I'm, I think I'm going to put three coats of this on here with uh, heat on it in between coats. Alright, so here we go. Here's my rendition, I guess you call it, for the um, 
SX5. So simple color patterns, at least I think how I look at it is gonna be simple. We got the clear windows we'll keep. Um, the trim around the windows, I think I'm gonna make that black. I try to do black or gray, but I don't have any gray. So the trim around the windows will be black. Um, this whole upper half cut down through the, the front will be gold. And then the lower half will all be purple, candy purple. So we got the candy purple and the candy gold on top. So we'll try that. We'll see how this goes, man. I'm not one way, shape, or form good at this stuff, but I figured this is a simple paint job and uh, we'll see what happens. All right, so far so good. Um, let's see if I can get this while I'm holding this camera. Just gotta peel back this masking. Like this. And I'm gonna tell you what. I am thinking of different designs as I'm doing this thing right now. I don't know yet, because this is coming off so nice, coming out so nice. get all these uh, windows out and we shall see. All right, so we're gonna use the Iwata um, airbrush for the masking around the, not masking, but or the molding, I guess, around the windows. We use this and use some black. I had to reduce it a little bit. Like I said, I don't know what the hell I'm doing, guys, so don't follow me. I'm just trying stuff that I think will work. <laughs> so here's the airbrush I'm gonna use here. And the line body paint. This is black. All right guys, so we got probably three coats of uh, the black now over top of the, um, the outline of the window molding, I guess it will be. And I'm gonna put one more on here and then we're gonna uh, hit it with the heat gun again. And then um, we should be ready for some, uh, some of the real color on this thing. So we'll do the black then we'll do the purple and then we'll finish off with the uh, candy gold. All right. Alright guys, day two um this paint job. Right, so I'm getting ready to do the um the purple now. So you can see I started already trimmed out the lines, so I'm just peeling back the uh the um the mask. Just peeling back the mask now. So I'll uh, check this out. Alright, so you can see peeling the mask back out. And like I said, this this makes life so much easier with this mask, dude. Just make sure your hands are clean. And uh, peel away. It's a little hard to do with one hand, but you get the idea. Rainy day out this jump, man. Oh, sky is all gray. A little humid out here. Good day for, um, you know, some uh, painting. So <sighs> we laid down a couple coats of the purple so far. Like I said, this is what I'm using. And it's going on pretty evenly, too. In between coats, I'm hitting it with the heat gun to speed up the process, but uh, it's looking like a paint job now. So I have, I think, three coats of candy on here now, candy purple, um, which is basically one can, one can, pretty much empty. Um, I'm going to finish up that can and then this can. So I have two cans of candy on here, and I'll throw the backer on it. So now we got one coat of the mirror. Chrome, the ultimate mirror chrome backer. Uh, 1009 is the number. Um, I'm gonna put, I think I'm gonna put two, maybe three coats on here. That's the first coat. I've already hit it with the heat gun sitting over there. And um, <clears throat> we'll uh, go from here. Like I said, I think I'm gonna put two coats on here, maybe three. All right, 
We got two coats of the mirror chrome on here now. Time to peel back this last layer of this onion and throw in some of this gold. Hopefully this turns out all right. I hope, I hope. <laughs> all right, so now we got the first uh, candy gold on there. Next, just got finished with the uh, heat gun. We're gonna spray it down probably two more times and then hit it with some of the mirror. And then we're gonna be done with this jump. We're ripping this uh, white film off, see how good this looks or how bad it looks. <laughs> All right, so now we got three coats of the candy gold on here. I got a little bit of set myself here in the front. Let it drip a little too much and I put the heat on it and I messed it up on the front. Got to be right in the front too, right? I'm blown, but I hope it looks all right. I'm gonna hit all this with some uh, silver backer now, and then probably just one coat of uh, black for everything, and then I'll be done. Damn, pissed with that. All right, got a good coat of silver backer on everything now, and I'm gonna hit it all with some black backer and be done with this jump. We'll be peeling this back. All right, so this is the high gloss black that we got on here. It's going on, but I'm making a mess. I don't understand why this one has this type of top on it when the others have this nice, easy spray top. <laughs> and this one was like super, super pressure to get the uh, paint to come out. So I don't know. Well, I'm almost done. Get this last piece on here. One more coat of the black. And we're done. So, Took a little bit of time, but not too bad. We're gonna peel off these uh, window masks, and then we're gonna um, peel off the um, outside, see what it's gonna look like. So I hit it with the heat gun, so everything's pretty dry now. So let's peel all these masks off. There we go. Outside, I put it right here. Doesn't look bad. Not bad for my uh, first candy paint job. That's real good. Rushing here, that messed me up. I had a couple spots up here, and I don't know where that came from. So, I guess some of the, I don't know, like some candy or something dripped on it. Don't know what that is. But, it's not bad. Um, the black trim around the windshields and everything looks good. And uh, oh no, shit, I'm gonna run this jump. Get them body mounts changed up, get the decals on here, and it'll be set. All right, see what we get here. Get that oil pressure up. Been sitting for like five minutes. I'm not even hitting the gas. All right, we got the oil brush up now. Hit the gas a couple times. The carburetor was empty as y'all saw. Right up, baby. What's up, folks? So we changed the 
jets on the primary is from 68 down to 66. I'm trying to get the air fuel ratio right. Why idling? They ain't smoking us out. Let it idle up a little bit. Take her out, baby. So you know I ain't taking her out. So I'm happy though. She ready, baby. Nothing but a G thing. Ready to go for another season, baby. Sounding good. Alright. What's your boy Crucial RC? I'm gonna wait for a nice, nice sunny day. I'm gonna take Shorty out. Alright? So I'll let you guys on the next one, man. Alright, yo.